Hey everyone, just had a really quick video to throw out. I uh, had some people asking what I use to get all my uh, images for websites and that kind of thing. And the place I go to is called iStockphoto.com. I'll provide a link below to their latest special or offer that they've got available, so just check it out in the description. Now this uh, iStock photo is supplied by Getty Images, so there is hundreds and hundreds of thousands of images available. And it's quite simple. Once you sort of sign up, uh, you just sort of search the type of image you're after, and it will come back with a list of photos for that sort of term business. I'm imagining it's going to be hundreds and hundreds of thousands. So there we go. There's actually 1.4 million results for that one, and it's simple. You just go through, find the type of image you want, click on it. and select the uh, file size you want. Now at the moment all the file sizes are the same price so you may as well grab the highest file quality you can and then you can always use a tool like Photoshop or, or whatever just to make it down to the size that you actually need it. Uh, but why not get why not uh, you know get the highest quality version of the image if you're going to be paying for it. Now this one says it's for about three credits uh, for memory, three credits costs about 36 Australian dollars, uh, and it gets cheaper sort of the more credits you buy. Um, so while it is a bit of an expensive option, you know this does get you professionally done photos. You do have the rights to use uh, for your on your website and stuff like that, and you won't sort of get in trouble for it. So I guess that's that's what you're paying for. Uh, it's important to note that when you are looking at the images, they do have different licenses. So some will have an editorial license and some will have a creative license. Uh, on the left hand panel you can actually filter filter those and if you want a better description of what those license types are all you have to do is sort of uh, hover over here and you get a bit of a description on uh, um, how you can use those too. So that's it for today. Really quick video. Just wanted to show you where and how we get our images for our web design projects. That's all. Thanks. If you have any questions, feel free to ask.